Through your goodness, O Lord, we have this bread and wine to offer. The fruit of the earth and the work of human hands, they will become our spiritual food. All things come from you, O Lord, and of your own do we give you. Blessed be God forever. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Lift up your hearts. Lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is, right to give him thanks and it is right and a good and joyful thing, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Father Almighty, everlasting God. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, who on the first day of the week overcame death and the grave, and by his glorious resurrection opened to us the way of everlasting life. Therefore we praise you, joining our voices with angels and archangels, and with all the company of heaven, who forever sing this hymn to proclaim the glory of your name. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of power and might, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. Today we're using prayer C. All holy and glorious Father, our Creator God, we give you thanks because in your loving wisdom you brought all things into being and are truly worthy of praise. From every creature you have made, again and again we have turned away from you, yet in every age your steadfast love has called us to return to live in union with you for it is your, in your eternal purpose to put life into all things and make them holy. Through your Son, Jesus Christ, who took our human nature upon him, you have redeemed the world from the bondage of sin. And by the power of your Holy Spirit, you have gathered a people to yourself to make known in every place his perfect offering which he made to the glory of your name. Hear us, therefore, Father, through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord, and grant that these gifts of bread and wine may be to us his body and blood. For on the night that he was betrayed, he took bread, and when he had given thanks to you, he broke it and gave it to his disciples and said, Take this and eat it. This is my body which is given for you. Do this for the remembrance of me. And after supper he took the cup of wine, and when he had given thanks, he gave it to them and said, Drink this, all of you. This is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Whenever you drink it, do this for the remembrance of me. Let us proclaim the mystery of our faith. Christ has died, Christ is risen, Christ will come again. And we offer our sacrifice of praise and thanksgiving to you, Lord of all, presenting to you from your creation this bread and this wine. We pray you, gracious God, to send your Holy Spirit on these gifts, that they may be the sacrament of the body of Christ and his blood of the new covenant. Unite us to your Son in his sacrifice, that we may be acceptable to him and be sanctified by the Holy Spirit. In the fullness of time, reconcile all things in Christ and make them new, and bring us to that city of light where you dwell with all your sons and daughters through Jesus Christ our Lord, the firstborn of all creation, the head of the church, and the author of our salvation. By whom and with whom and in whom, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all honor and glory is yours, almighty Father, now and forever. Amen. As our Savior has taught us, so we pray. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. 
Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. We break this bread to share in the body of Christ. Though we are many, we are one body, because we all share in one body. Jesus, Lamb of God, have mercy on us. Jesus, bearer of our sins, have mercy on us. Jesus, redeemer of the world, give us peace. the gifts of God for the people of God. The body of Christ, the bread of heaven. We pray together. Eternal God and Heavenly Father, we thank you for feeding us with the body and blood of your Son, Jesus Christ. Send us now into the world in peace and grant us strength and courage to love and serve you and all persons in you with gladness and singleness of heart through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. And now the blessing of God Almighty, Creator, Redeemer and Sustainer be upon you now and remain with you always.